I don't know if that makes any sense. And yeah, that, well, that's how the powers come into play, my friend. <laughs> right. That that's where like, because there's there's so many different theories. Like I went to this I went to this seminar um, several years ago, contact in the desert, and for people who are interested in in extraterrestrials, UFOs, and things of that nature. When, when you hear people talk who really dedicated their life to figuring out what life is and all these different concepts, people who have clearance to go to Antarctica, um, you know, people that have seen things that they can't quite explain. For, for me, what gives me peace within all of this for my journey, you know, going on shamanic journeys, going on vision quests, um, lots of different forms of meditation that we're not we're not all this is where there's like different levels as i'm sure you've experienced in the in the journey of awakening of self-discovery of who am i why am i here what is my purpose that you know some people are meant to believe one way and some people are meant to believe another way and one of my mentors shaman durek um d-u-r-e-k he's amazing and one of the things that he helped me with was one day he was doing a live stream and and we were talking and he said you know you need to stop resenting humanity. And this was several years ago. And I really stopped and I thought about that, how we live in this world of like, oh, they're in the matrix. Oh, they're they're NPCs. Oh, they're background characters. Oh, they're not real. Oh, I'm the chosen one. All these different kind of concepts that it's really being able to understand the concept of mirroring and and uh, and when when there's something that I don't like about you, then that's because there's something that I don't like about myself and also understanding that people are also showing us how we believe about ourselves and how and what our beliefs are on life. And also, you know, really what started to become interesting within my life was when I really started to focus on my beliefs and really started to focus on changing my beliefs. Um, I was walking when I lived in Manhattan, I was living, um, I was walking, going to my PO box and I just started creating the belief in my life when I would walk down the street of, what if the people in front of me knew that somebody important, that royalty was coming through? Not to say that I'm better than them, but just purely out of out of an exper um, experiment kind of thing to do, to, to see like, if I truly believe that and I projected that forward. And I noticed as I kept on doing this, eventually I got people to naturally start walking to the side. So for me, life life is truly what i believe it to be and then when i when i see other people who don't have my belief system this is where for me one of my main goals has always been that i want to make the concept of reincarnation mainstream which it is in other parts of the world and when we look at reincarnation we can understand why other people don't match our belief systems that people are meant to learn about different lessons in the same way I've done past life regression. And and when people who don't even know my story tell me, hey, like in this lifetime, you felt this way and this way. And that's directly connected to why I keep on having these feelings when I get around this person or these circumstances. So the only way that I've made peace in my life is by going into these studies, what you're talking about, going into the ancient wisdom stuff and finding the balance so that I'm not resenting the other people who are quote unquote sleeping. They're a mirror to show me, hey, you have a solution. You can do something about this. You can change the world. So I'm going to keep on doubting you and putting fear into your life and putting anger into your life to see if you're going to give me anger back or if you are going to show me love and be that nurturing parent, you know, that that other person never had. So being able to you know, make peace that other people may never believe how I believe. However, when I show you love and you feel good about yourself, that will naturally change who you are. And that's where in, in all of this conversation, what we're doing right now, now that we're in this age of Aquarius, is we're going into the space of I know. And, and when I know, when I'm confident, when I'm secure, if you tell me that I'm stupid, if you tell me that I'm wrong, and I actually attack you or I put you down, I actually doubt myself.